Hi there. Welcome to this series of videos on programming logic. We would start with simple programs like even numbers, odd numbers, how to find if a number is prime, find factorial of a number, and then move on to complex data structures and also algorithms. In this video, let's look at how to write a program to find out the simple interest. Uh, simple interest is over a principal. Uh, that's basically how much amount is lent. For example, let's say I've lent a uh, thousand rupees or thousand dollars, whichever com currency you are comfortable with. So let's say thousand units of currency I've lent at a rate of five percentage over a period of two years. So what would be the simple interest be? The way you would calculate it is using uh, like if it's five percent, so that's basically zero point zero five. Uh, that's that multiplied by two. So this gives you the interest part of the calculation. So uh, this is the amount of interest that needs to be charged. That's basically I think thousand into two is two thousand into point zero five. So that's point one. That's hundred rupees. So hundred units. So this is the interest, and to this we need to add the principal. That is the original amount which we lent that returns the total amount after simple interest. So this is the calculation which we are trying to implement. If you look at what we have done, the entire calculation can be simplified into this formula. That's basically principal multiplied by one plus rate into years. So the rate into years gives me one plus rate into years gives me the multiplication component which I have to multiply the principal with. One thing I should be careful with is the value which should be passed to rate. Usually when I say 5, the value actually is uh, 0 0.05. Uh, if I say 5 percentage, it's actually 0 0.05. So it's what we mean here is rate by 100. So uh, if you look at the program, the one thing we should be careful about is uh, the uh, data types principal can be thousand point like thousand and two rupees fifty pies so I use a float and rate can be five point five percent or six point five percent as well so I use a float for that as well yes I'm assuming that the years are uh, integers so I'm writing a program for which uh, I would calculate only for uh, complete years so uh, these are the assumptions we are making. Uh, if you look at the program, the program itself is very simple. Um, it's principal multiplied by 1 plus rate by 100 into years. That's exactly the formula we wrote here and we return the amount back. And if you look at how we invoke it from the main, that's also very simple. I use percentage %f and I invoke the function passing the values 1000 and 5 and 2. So it's 1000 rupees lent at 5% interest for 2 years. The interest component of this it comes to 100 rupees. So the total sum after 2 years would be 1100 rupees. So if I run the program, you would see that the output which is presented out is amount simple interest is 1100. So there you go. That's a very simple program to calculate simple interest of alone. If you like this video, show it by clicking like or commenting or sharing this video. We are creating more videos on varied range of topics as we speak. Subscribe to stay updated. Thanks for watching. Until next time. Bye.